Hey, what's going on guys? Today I will be doing another spot video. So today we are on the new Dust 2 map and I have taken some tips from you guys of what to do to make the bots not shoot. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, oh, I can't jump into them. Oh, that sucks. But I'll be showing you some cool spots on the new Dust 2 map and just some kind of big changes that I've seen recently. So I think you can get boosted up into this now. I don't have anybody to help me. I think you may be... Yeah, you can get there by yourself, so that's pretty nice. You can get people from right here and just get them all there. So, these are some new spots. I, I This is the first time I've loaded into this map, so I may not know all of them, but I'm pretty sure you can boost up there too because there's a little le a ledge right here. So, definitely it looks like it. And up here, this is the same as last time you can get up here. I think you had to get boosted up there last time on the old map, but I can't remember. And then... There's a molly, you can maybe stay on this so you don't get burned by the Molotov or whatever. I don't really know. And then they kind of made this look a lot nicer in my opinion. Yeah, you can't stand on that, I don't believe. Okay, yeah, that'd be really OP if you could. But yeah, you can just keep peeking up here and stuff. There's kind of a box there, so it may be a bit harder to do some of those jump shots. There's some stairs to go down. And this is kind of more sloped right here, so you can't really camp here anymore. And it's kind of like poked out more. And down here they changed so much. Like there's no more car boost spots. Like there's this building right here. So you can't get any of those uh, boost shots over that or anything like that anymore. It's just gone. And yeah. You can still get up here like that. And just plant like so. And stuff like that. Same back area as usual. And really nothing else has changed here. Besides maybe going up here. That's pretty cool, and yeah, this box right here is also new. Like they had, they didn't add that. Like they didn't have that before. So that box, like I said, is also new uh, because you can camp behind this and throw grenades over the walls and stuff, and you have more cover. And that area is also a lot more open, so you can shoot people. Uh, I'm not sure if you can get up here. You could probably easily get boosted up there, though. Yeah, you could probably get boosted up there. There's a more open, this, this area seems more open and they got more, like they got new pictures. Like you can see these, these people look a lot different than they used to. And right here, you can no longer boost right from right here, but you can jump and get some nice shots from here and stuff like that. But there's a box right here. So it's a lot easier to do now, but you just have to be on the front side, which kind of sucks. For some people that were good at doing it on the back side, but that's one major change from middle. And there's not much really else over here. I mean, this area is more open. You could also stand on here to get some surprise angles on people. This, I'm pretty sure I saw you can get boosted into, or people can stand on it like without getting boosted. I know I've seen that before, but now we will be going down a long area. So this car is really the same. This area hasn't really changed at all either. Long doors, this area is a lot more open so you can throw nades up higher and stuff like that. This area is just a lot nicer. You could probably still get boosted up there, I, I, I suppose. This you may be able to get boosted up into now. I, it doesn't seem like it, but you may be able to. I can't quite tell because I don't have anybody to boost you with me, but you may be able to and yeah. So over here you can see that this kind of looks bare. There's no more of these wood, or like this walkway across. So you can't necessarily camp on that. But you can still camp down here and watch bomb from here if you plant it right there. Which is really nice. And then they kind of made this area a bit more like poked back. Like you can peek it easier now. And then they kind of took away all of this stuff over here. I mean you can still jump up onto this and stuff like that. But that area is just a lot like more open and stuff like that. So that's basically it for long. We will move on to B site. Before we move on to B site, I'll just show some of more of mid. Like there's a lot of areas right there you can like bounce around in like usual. This is a kind of a new spot. I'm pretty sure because I don't think you can get this close to the last truck. And you may be able to get boosted up here. I'm not sure. Here, let's see. Um. Where could we try and throw this? 
Um, let's see. Okay, that is a box. You cannot jump up on there, apparently. And this is like normal. Uh, same old jumping area. This has also not changed. Actually, it may have. I think this has gotten a bit shorter, so you can boost up to the very top part. I don't think you could do that before. This area really hasn't changed in that corner. And over here, it's changed a bit. I think they added this wall. I can't remember. I can't remember if that wall was that tall before or not. Same area, really. This box may be a bit easier to peek behind, I, I feel. And then one thing which really sucks is how you used to be able to plant the bomb right uh, like right here in the little flap. That's no longer a thing, so there's no secret spots to plant the bomb, but you know, it's okay. And then you can camp right here and get some nice shots. Don't don't mind my shot. I'm, this is literally like my first game after like uh, not playing for like five days, but there's so many spots here still. Like you can jump up there as well. And it's still the same, but we will go on to the tunnels now. Tunnels, this box is, just, I think, bigger. I mean, it doesn't really change anything because you can still camp behind it without being seen. This uh, area, still the same, like, area. I mean, they may have added this little wall thing so you could, like, camp this a bit easier. I don't really know. But it's the same thing where you, if you camp down here, they can see your feet and stuff like that. Like, I mean, it just looks different. And I know everybody's done this, but you cannot throw those through this. Like, it doesn't go through. It comes right back down. Like, you may think you may go through, but it doesn't. And, like, yeah, I don't think you can hit that. I don't know if I hit it or not. But I don't. I doubt the thing has a hit. Okay, I, it may have a hit point thing. But you're not even going to really shoot up there because these doors are so open. There's really no point. And then these poles just look so much nicer. And it's basically the same tunnels that we're used to. Just a lot op more open and stuff like that. And I think this is like new so you, you can like throw it right, right there. And it's just easier to firebomb that. I don't really know. But that's just in my opinion it seems easier to firebomb and stuff like that. And this area... I mean, it's a lot bigger. I think there used to be a couple boxes over here too, but they kind of just took all that out as well. And then the T spawn hasn't really changed. I mean, there there used to be a car right here. Now there's just like this box to camp behind if you're saving after you plant the bomb or something. So it's not as useful anymore. And then you can still, I think, get up here. I can't really tell. Let me just get a running jump. Well, I don't know if you can or not, I guess. You can't. I, I don't really know. It appears you can't. Oh, you have to go right here. Okay, never mind. Get stacked on top of the trash to get up here. So that's uh, kind of cool, I guess. And then I think they added this car here. I don't remember there being a car here before. But, uh, well, now there is. So it's basically the same spawn as before. Just that car and some stuff like that. But yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.